everyone, welcome to my channel, today Matt Builds. Today I'm doing issue 127 of the Titanic, The Ship, The Legend by Harshet Partworks and there's no cranes to build in this one, thank God. So, let's make a start. Okay, 127, I'll just move me a cup of tea. And coming in issue 128, another crane and two brackets. And we've got the Majestic living up to its name. And she was majestic, very majestic. Beautiful ship. And you don't see liners like this anymore, the old, the old ones. Absolutely beautiful. And a photograph of Majestic's Palm Court taken in 1922. That is very nice. And now we come on to the uh, build instructions. Details for the poop deck. So I like all we do is put these connectors on here. I've been secured with AP screws with the connectors. And then we attach it to the poop deck using AP screws and then we adjoin this deck if I can find it to the poop deck and we start adding detail here the, the vents and storage compartments so let's make a start I need to find the other... Ah, oh, there it is, I know where it is, it's on the ship. And it's underneath the uh, bridge deck, so... I'll just get them both out. Right, here we go. Hmm. Need this part. Been pre-painted. Ready to go on. Screws. So I just put the stuff in there so I don't lose them. And there's one thing I don't like are these stairs. They look absolute cheap and nasty. But there's not much I can do with it. I'm going to have to sort something out. But there, I think I've still got some photo etch stairs, so I'll have to have a look for them. So I'm not going to put them on just yet. Right, so I need the screws. Need all of them, all but one. Maybe trusty screwdriver. Now we need is this. Three connectors. We've got the key shape here, which go on there like that. So we'll get the first one screwed together. And I've just been to Berry Market today. I uh, got myself some more Citadel paint canister to spray the Enterprise because I did buy two last time and I don't know where they are. So that's one. I'll just bring the camera down so you can see. I thought it was already down. Sorry about that, guys. And tomorrow, what I'm thinking of doing, because I did a bit more 
to the elevator yesterday off camera but I've not done the other side yet so I'll uh, do that and show you actually I'll show you what I've done in a bit once I've done this okay so that's them on like that then now we know what what we're going to do now turn it up your side down and it'll be going on like that so <coughs> put it down gently <coughs> Oh, excuse me. So I'm gonna get this screwed into here. Like so. It's a shame this is coming to an end this year. I mean I've really enjoyed doing this, even though I've still got Peters to do. But when this comes to an end, that's it. There's two. And that's three. So that is that on. Bit of a gap. Not much, but a gap. I hate gaps. And it is tight. Now the next thing we need to do these notches here. they will be going into them notches there okay. like so and that will be held with four AP screws So I'll do the two front ones here. Like that. This is looking marvellous every time. I mean these cranes should be that loose I'll put one here out of the way get the other screw Just put it in the hole it's all going So, and screw it down. And there we have it. That's the two decks joined together. And I've seen um, that it's a snug fit when we did eventually put the deck in the hull a very snug fit but um, I've seen a way that John's model making had done is now it's saying to put the stairs on but I'm, I'm gonna leave the stairs off for now 
because I don't like them stairs at all. It's like with the um, on the forecastle. I'm thinking of taking them ones off, turn the steps around so I can put the photo etch ones on. Which I should have done that long ago, but it doesn't really matter. Now let's see if this gel is still feasible that I left in here. No, it's not. It's gone off. Okay, no problem. Uh, use a glue here. Uh, another tree. Just a bit of glue. Don't need a lot. Gorilla's glue. Right. So we've got three holes. Now then. These three here. Where the seats are going to go. So we'll put the big one in first. Is a tough fit. Very tough fit. I don't know why I bother gluing it to be honest. That's one. Wow, didn't expect that to be that tough. Let's try the other two, see how they are. Which I don't think these need gluing. No, they fit in perfectly. That, they're very snug, you know. There we go. That's M3 in. Now let's see how these fit. So we've got a thick lug and a thin lug. Just want to make sure I'm getting the right way. here let's see how these fit if these are a snug fit well they're not coming out so they don't need gluing excellent and that'll go on there and that'll go there wow That's what you call a tight fit. Excellent. And that is issue 127 completed. Well, that was a quick issue. Didn't take long. As you can see now, the vents on and the storage compartments looking rather grand. I must admit, though, that, that big vent and the other storage box, must admit, they are a snug fit. Don't need gluing, which is good. Looking rather nice. And it'll be even nicer when it's on the ship itself. Beautiful, absolutely beautiful. Uh, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to show you what I did yesterday, like I promised. Uh, 
I added that part there and this part here yesterday. That one part, this here, uh, sorry, this here took me two hours to do. Took a long while and it seems to be coming away. Yeah, it is, it's coming away. So I'm going to have to re glue that. Fiddly it was, very fiddly. And but worth it. Loved every minute of it. And I've got another one of these to go on yet, so I'll do that tomorrow. And I'm looking forward to my uh photo etch bender to come. Because that will come in handy. It'll be next week when that comes. So, I just want to do a bit more work on that. Uh, instructions. Right, because it, like all the small details to go on, which I'll just show you there. That's just for the hanger alone. Not the hanger, the uh, rear, uh, rear flight deck to go on. And then I've got another part there to do. I'll tell you something, it is challenging, enjoyable, can't complain. I just love these photo etch parts, they're just absolutely amazing. So for the stairs, for the Titanic, now I did put them somewhere, but the question is where, but I'll find them and I'm going to put them on the ship, even on the uh, forecastle that I've got spare, because I, I don't like these stairs, them ones, there's just no detail to them at all, they haven't even got the safety rail, you know, the, well, the rails either side. Whereas the photo etch has. So I'm going to have to take this apart again. And. Actually, it won't take too long. Because what I'll have to do is turn the stairs around inside so I've not got a gap there. And the photo etch will be going on. If I can find it. So guys, I think that's about it. I don't think there's anything else. Um, no. Uh, that with the next issue, as I said, it'll be another crane and brackets. And I think how many cranes have we got left to do? Two more. So issue 130 will be another crane, the last of them. No it won't. Because we've got two on the uh, front well deck. There's another two to go there. So I better get them photo etches on very soon. So anyway guys, I'm going to get going. I'm going to have my mug of tea now. So if you like this video, please give it a massive thumbs up. And if you haven't already subscribed, please subscribe. And don't forget to hit that notification bell for future videos. So until tomorrow guys, for the... Uh, Enterprise build, well the rear elevator, whatever it's called. Y'all stay safe, take care, and I'll see you then. Bye for now.